Hey, 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 what's going on YouTube? Taka Tanaka Giants here with a mail day for you guys. I got some stuff in the mail. And uh, I also got some uh, pack breaks that I did with my students. So I'll be sharing those with you guys if y'all don't mind. This is from a 2012 BBM Hunching Tigers variety. Some, uh, nothing too crazy, but some really nice looking cards. So I'll show those to you guys in a second. But um, I want to start off this video with a question. Uh, I was kind of curious what you guys are watching on TV. What kind of shows are really cool? What's, uh, what keeps you entertained? Uh, I found a couple. I found a really nice site over here that can provide me with links to watch TV shows. Basically, anything that's on television. There's episode links, and I can kind of watch those um, even here in Japan. So, I've been trying to catch up on a little bit of TV. Being here in Japan, it's I'm a little bit, I guess, late with a lot of the the news and what's hot on television. I'm not really familiar. Um, right now, let's see. I just finished watching uh, Gang Related, which is pretty neat. Uh, I like that one a lot. I thought that was pretty cool cool show and I think it's on um, I think it just finished the last episode so uh, waiting for season two to start up um, I know a lot of the major ones like Walking Dead I watched that waiting for that one to come back um, I'm in the middle of The Leftovers right now which is kind of like a uh, well it's an HBO series I believe and it's like two percent of the world's population suddenly disappears and kind of the aftermath of dealing with the unanswered questions blah 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 so that's i've watched like three episodes of it and it's all right it's uh it's kind of interesting but it's kind of curious what you guys watch and um what you guys recommend i guess uh anything i guess I i'm not really I'm, i can't follow the game of thrones too much i know it's like very popular but uh i think it's like already on season five or six and i'm i'm too far behind so uh, i don't know if i want to Spend my time catching up on that one. But if there's anything you guys recommend, feel free to uh, leave a comment down below. But anyways, guys, yeah, so I do have the pack breaks. Um, two packs, 2012 Hanshin Tigers BBM. And this is what I got. Uh, not really in any particular order. This is the uh, this is the base version right here. That's what they look like. And then this is the refractor version. Make sure it's in focus. There we go. So kind of the refractor version. Base, base, I guess some of these random insert cards. I thought this was pretty interesting. Tigers from overseas. You have some of the international players, like uh, Randy Messenger here, who I believe used to play for the Marlins. Um, yep, he did. He sure did. He played for the Marlins back in 99. And the Mariners and Giants as well, before coming to Japan. Um, some more insert cards, cool insert cards, dual insert cards. Um, this is probably my favorite card of the whole lot. It's just random base, but nice Matt Merton. Tiger's Roar has a nice texture to it, kind of like sandpaper, but uh, sandpaper and then gloss right here. But he was a big time prospect with the Cubs and Red Sox back in the day, but never really panned out. Does very, very well over here in Japan, though. But yeah, so that's kind of my uh, two pack break. Let me know what you guys think. I think they're interesting products. And then the stuff that I got in the mail, uh, starting off. Just this lot of golf cards from SP Game Used. This is the card that I wanted, so I put up on top. But McElroy, Woods, Johnny Miller, and Gary Player, all on one nice card. And the rest of these are just random tour gear combos. Um, if you guys are interested in anything, really, just feel free to let me know. But um, majority of this stuff's probably going to my eBay store. Uh, yeah, so I uh, got that going on. What else? I have another lot. Uh, I did pick up. One baseball card, well, at least this is in this stack here. But Anthony Rizzo from 2013 Museum, really solid out of 399. Looking forward to what the Cubs can bring to the table next season. It can be highly competitive, in my opinion, but we'll see. Uh, this is, the rest of this is all basketball, and then I have some more baseball over here. But basketball 2012, no, sorry, 2013 14, 2014, I guess, Panini Signatures, draft pick number 12 exchange card. I'm not really sure who that is, I have to figure that out. And then uh, I'll just uh, say the name and what kind of card it is. But Andre Robinson, uh, Robertson, sorry. It's kind of neat, see-through. Eddie Johnson. A, uh, Matthew De La, Devo De La Vedova. De La Vedova. De La Vedova. De La <laughs> sorry. De La Vedova. There we go. That's probably better. Uh, Keith Van Horn. Luis Scola. The, uh, Solomon Hill. And a Bobby Jackson. Reggie Bullock, Michael Cooper, Tom Van Arsdale. Not really sure who this player is. I'm not really sure who a lot of the players are, honestly, but uh, this is just kind of a resell lot that I picked up. And a uh, metallic marks of Detlef Schremp 
Shrimpiv. Shrimpiv. Not really sure how to pronounce that. But, um, yeah, that's kind of a basketball lot that I got. That's all eBay fodder. If you guys are interested, let me know. And then uh, baseball. So I did pick up a card from, once again, my favorite seller over here. He included this nice Mike Trout archives, I think, uh, base card. I, I like this card design. I think this card looks really sharp. And then uh, this card that I picked up from him, nice chrome heritage at a 565. And in a very nice and brand new magnetic. Can't go wrong with that. And then the last card is from the new Topps Finest. Uh, this is this is pretty nice. I'm not really sure what parallel this is called. I know it's a refractor, but I'm not really sure what color they used for this one because it's kind of hard to tell. But uh, it is out of 50. Pretty nice. Mike tried again. But yeah, so uh, I do got some other stuff coming in later on this week or probably the beginning of next week now that it's already uh, almost the weekend for me or the weekend rather. But, um, yeah, I'll kind of keep you guys informed and up to date. And if you guys can be so kind as to let me know what you guys are watching on TV or what you guys recommend, I'd love to catch up. But that's it, guys. Thanks for watching, and I uh, hope the hobby's treating you all well. Talk to you later. Peace. Bye-bye.